Okay, so what I really like about the format are two things. And the first thing is that it's really small, so you actually get to interact with all the people, uh, which is really nice. And the second thing, which is sort of related to it, is that it's repetitive. So it's not just one workshop where you meet people and you never see them again, but you see them repeatedly and you get used to them and you get used to their ideas and their problems as well. And you can tackle those problems together, sort of. So that's uh, what I like about the format. And what I like about bringing people from different disciplines together in general is that you get new ideas and new um, sort of points of view for the problems. So it's, it's great, it's a good idea. And if people are willing to collaborate, just let's do it. Okay, I'm not exactly sure how to answer that, uh, but I come from uh, originally from religious studies, so my training is in like classical religious studies. But I switched for experimental methods later on. So nowadays I mainly do experiments and experimentation in looking in various phenomena that can be found also in religious. Uh, experiences and religious behavior. Uh, the topic I'm mostly focusing on is the embodiment of cognition theory. And in relation to religion, it's how bodily postures used in religion and religious rituals, for example, can influence our cognitive and emotive and other processes. Um, I think it's uh, mainly about that there are people who are willing to collaborate and talk about problems rather than the limitations of disciplines that are quite different, uh, which is great because it seems that you really need to combine methodologies uh, to tackle like broader problems and areas such as religion and religious experience.